This does not look like Florida anymore. Not at all. Welcome everybody to another Glass Geek vlog. Vlog that used to be daily is not so much daily anymore. Florida about a day ago, a day and a half ago I guess. And I'm already up here in Iowa, almost to Des Moines. I shall park and download a bunch of video from my weekend home. I, I, I'm not exactly sure what's on that video stuff that I'm going to be yanking off that other camera. Pretty sure it's a lot of RV stuff from the RV show in Tampa that I didn't use that I meant to, but I, 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 I didn't put to use. Plan is to go ahead, get parked, yank all that video off the other camera, put some music to it, and uh, just let you guys see all the stuff that did not show up in that vlog. The, the vlog from the RV show. Probably not going to be that interesting. Wasn't that fun and exciting? I, I I don't know if it was. It was just B footage that I meant to put to music and put in that video and brain fart. It never happened. Anyway, so that was a little bit more of the RV show. Some multi-million dollar RVs in that quick little clips right there. Some of them were right up there in two and three million dollar range. They were they were kind of expensive. Anyway, now that we got that out of the way. I wanted to show you guys something that I purchased the other day at Best Buy. Now you guys all know that I went ahead and I got some filters, though I haven't figured out how to use them quite yet for the Mavic. There's one on there, but I'm not sure exactly what it does. Right now I'm just using it kind of as a protector type thing on there, but these other two are really dark. And I will be using those eventually, but I figured why do I just focus on this new toy when I haven't really used it too much yet? When this toy here, I use a lot more at the moment. So why not see if they had any filters for it? Because the camera is way different. And so are the filters. Yep, 
got some. Same old, same old. I was just shooting the video showing you guys that stuff. My battery died as I was doing an unboxing. Look, I already opened the box. So how can I complete this? Let's see here. Um, okay, quick look at the box. It's pretty much the same box as the ones I got for the Mavic. Uh, a fixed polarized ND8 three stop filter and an ND16 as my camera starts to fall again. Uh, neutral density four stop filter. I'm not exactly sure what four stop filter and three stop filter means. I, I don't understand those yet. I've been watching quite a few YouTube videos, but I don't think anybody has said anything about that before. Okay, so box is empty. I'm actually going to keep this box. I threw the last box away without getting an idea of exactly what these are supposed to do, which it does show an image on the back of these boxes. So inside, pretty much the same exact filter setup that the Mavic has, except they're just a little bit different shape because the camera's different on the Mavic. And you also get da, 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 another Polar Pro sticker. It can go on my case, I already have one on there. You get another cleaning cloth. You can never have too many cleaning cloths. And instructions, which I did not read last time either. Though I have not flown the Mavic enough with the filters on. To, to, in fact, I've only had the one filter on, and it is the fixed polarized and I, I haven't seen any difference with the fixed polarized lens on there so I, I need to really try the other filters so on the spark I think I'm going to go for this ND8 and just put it on and and forget about that polarized thing right now and uh, start flying it around and see if it makes a difference because I have other footage up and so any new footage I put up will be shot with this and I'll be able to tell if there's a difference or not. Oh, as I start to drop them. So there they are in their case. Pretty nice. I don't even know if the camera's focusing on those. They're really, really nice. And I'm going to take the center one out because that's the one I'm going to use. Now I do know on... Uh, on the Mavic filters, it doesn't say whether, it, you know, what it is, if it's in any of those, it doesn't say. This one here, it does say, it says right on the top what it is. But also, ah, focus, also on the Mavic filters, they're round, they're little discs. And before you put them on, you're supposed to just hold them up close to the camera and rotate it slowly and, and look through the viewfinder and see that proper, the way it's, the way you want it to look. And then you slowly slide it on in place. And, and Because I guess as you rotate it, it gives you different whatever, it, whatever filters do. There's no way to rotate these ones. It's just a cap, pretty much. So I guess you just slap it on and you get what you get. The cam like I said, the camera on this is a little bit different. And the gimbal is, I don't feel like I'm going to break the gimbal off on this one. Whereas on the Mavic, I do. it's really sensitive. But if you look on the back of the camera here, there, there's a little gash where it looks like uh, for cooling or something. And I think this just uh, clips in. somehow oh got my fingerprint right in it this is not as easy as i thought it was going to be definitely not easy to put that on it feels like it might fall off but it probably won't whereas on the mavic it snaps into place this one here just kind of goes around the camera lens, lens a little bit and then it has it has a long part that just flaps over the top but really doesn't grab a hold of anything so, am I a little bit worried about it? A little bit. But you know what? 
my camera has a timer going right down the middle of the screen. Why is it there? But you know what? Did, did, did that fix it? I bet you when I shot that video just now, it was sideways for some reason. I, I have no idea. But what doesn't feel flimsy is their cases. These cases feel really sturdy. Not exactly sure. Yeah, they're easy. They, it was hard to open at, at the first, but it's extremely easy right now. These, these things are pretty sturdy, nice for storing stuff. But I think I'm gonna leave that filter on for now because I never know when I'm gonna fly it. Anyway, that's what I got at Best Buy. Another set of filters. Was that exciting? I don't know. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and sign off. Now remember, this coming Friday, if I have 50 or more thumbs up on last Friday's video, I haven't checked it yet, but if I have 50 likes or more, ugh. Okay, this is not good. Where are you? It's in here somewhere. I know it is. Where did I put it? Camera stuff. Camera stuff. Where did I... Where? I don't know where I put it. That is not good. You guys are seeing me make a mess in here. Maybe, maybe I didn't put it in here. I didn't. I put it in here, in my swag bag. 50 thumbs up or more, guys. I'm giving this away. To one of you guys. But if I don't get 50 likes, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Because I, I, I want to give it to somebody. So hopefully they're there. Hopefully Thursday night, before I go to bed, I go to check that video and there's 50 thumbs up. Because I do. I want, I want one of you guys to have this. Alright. So until the next one, everybody. I love you all. Peace out.